All right, what's going on guys? Delta, welcome back to another episode of my Elite Weapons of Grandmaster Prestige in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And today we're going to be taking a look at the Master Prestige 14 weapon, the HBRA3 Bare Fist. Now, it's crazy to know that we're almost at the end of the series. I can't wait to close it out and just be done with it because we already hit Grandmaster Prestige, so it's time to finish it off. So expect a double upload uh, this weekend for the Strider and the AK-12, rest in peace. But today we're covering the Bare Fist, the HBRA3 Elite version. It's really good, but let's check out the stats on screen here. So the HBR3 Bare Fist has a plus two handling. It's got a minus one accuracy, minus one range, and a built-in red dot sight. Now let's start off with the positives first. We got a plus two handling, which is huge, man. For assault rifles, you guys know that they don't have really good hip fire accuracy unless you put a red, or not a red dot, a laser sight on it. And even if you put that laser sight on it, it still lacks a little bit of hip fire accuracy. But with plus two handling on the HBR3, it's our, the HBR3 is already accurate enough, but when you put plus two handling on, handling on it, it's going to be super good at close range when you're hip firing, which is awesome. And you notice right off the bat when you hip fire with this HBR3 uh, bare fist, you're going to be like, wow, man, this is really good, actually. It's like a straight, straight line. It just hits hard when it hip fires and stuff. But anyways, we also got a minus one accuracy. Now, you're going to notice the minus one accuracy a little bit. It's going to kick a little bit extra. But, you know, you can always throw on a foregrip to solve that. You also got a minus one in range, which isn't too bad. I mean, the HBR3 is pretty good with range even if you take like minus one or even minus two off of it it's still a pretty decent gun at range so you also have a built-in red dot sight now i don't know about you guys but personally me i love the red dot sight on hbr a3 i cannot use any variant of the hbr a3 without a red dot i really really wish they would bring out a red dot sight for the insanity but I'm glad that they actually made it built in for this gun because, you know, it doesn't uh, cost you a point for your pick 13, which is really good. And you could just take advantage of that red dot sight. Now, I want to get into a little bit of detail with this gun. Now, when you use this gun at range, that guy was weak, by the way. <laughs> but when you usually use this gun at range or you're aiming down sights and trying to pick off a target for medium long range, it definitely seems to not kill as fast. It This definitely feels like a gun that kills faster up close this version however the other hbr3 versions i can't speak for but this version however it feels like when you get really close up it definitely packs a lot more damage like when you're when you're right in the enemy's face it really really just hits them hard i don't know if that's because of the plus two handling or something or what it is or maybe it has like maybe this gun has a certain secret to it where if you get closer um because the accuracy and stuff is down i guess it does more damage i don't i don't really know but it definitely feels like when you're closer with this gun, it does a lot more damage. But at range, this thing is just is super weak. I mean, like, you'll, you'll see yourself getting a lot of hit markers. But however, you used to, like, the standard HBR 3 variant, you're not going to get as many hit markers as you will with this gun. But overall, this gun is pretty good. I definitely like the built-in red dot sight. I think that's really, really helpful. That plus two handling is definitely good for hip firing and stuff like that. So it's a really good gun. But hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, drop a like on it and make sure to subscribe for more future Call of Duty content every single day. And if you guys want to, check out my social media links in the description below. But thanks for watching, guys. And it's been Delta, and I'm signing out.